So today we're going to be doing one of the things we love to do the most, and it's organize. Yeah. All right, so here's the progress so far. What is that? More boys. Oh. Ocean girl, are you six months today? I look crazy. Tell me how I look black this year. So yeah, so I like how it turned out. I don't know, do you like it? I love it. Yeah? For real. Hey guys. Hey, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. Hope you, you've you been liking the videos and, and if you're enjoying it, don't forget to subscribe. So today we're going to be doing one of the things we love to do the most. <laughs> if anyone can relate and it's organize. Yeah. yeah. So currently from, I don't know what you guys can see, um, we're living in a studio size room, right? Mm. So. We did get rid of a lot of things, almost like every, what, three months, I think. Mm -hmm. um, we tried to just organize, just see what we're using, what we're not using, what we can give away, what we can throw away, what we can store, um, especially for like Ocean's clothes that she's growing out of them so quick. Mm -hmm. By the way, here she is, <laughs> wearing her cloth diapers. For the first time. We'll be doing a separate video on that because we just started, so. We'll let you know in another video how that's going <laughs> so yeah so we do that every three months and it's been pretty much three months since we moved yeah um so we're gonna do that today and if we don't get done we'll finish tomorrow but yeah anything else wanna... no let's i mean let's start doing it let's so we're gonna caffeinate because we need a little bit of caffeine and we'll kind of just take you guys through everything kind of how we organize we consider like okay, we don't use this anymore, what we can do with it, repurpose it, whatever, all that good stuff. Right. All right. So currently, we're just doing all our laundry first. That's what we usually do with our clothes. And there on, we kind of see where we're at, what we have, and what we've been washing so often and what we haven't really used. What are you eating? Are you eating a banana? Is that good? Organizing with a baby, easier said than done. So this is kind of what we have. So we started this box um, of like clothes that didn't fit her. So we gotta go through this and make it better. Um, then I kind of started with these drawers. This is gonna be the pile of stuff that we're gonna give away. And then here we're gonna have a, like a throwaway pile. Um, up here I started like the storing so like these shoes that don't fit her anymore, um, these like winter things, things like that. And then we have this guy over here. So we know the TV, we don't watch TV. <laughs> it's just there, which is kind of annoying, but whatever, <laughs> it's fine. But this guy has been useful. This was there too. I've been putting like makeup and books and papers and little like miscellaneous things that we do use. So I also kind of want to organize if we get to it. Yes. So right now we just took a break to eat something yummy with some sparkling water. And then it's just gonna be me and Ocean right now. Just trying Greek yogurt for the first time with some steak. And yeah, Ocean. Seems like she's loving it. Ocean girl. Are you six months today? Yeah, she's enjoying her sign. <laughs> hey guys, how are you? So today is six months of Ocean's life here on Earth. Celebrating today. I know, it's so crazy. Can't believe she's six months already. I know. I'm grabbing my arm is about to fall. Yeah. I know, from five to six months, you can see so many big like steps. Mm -hmm. From how much she grew to the things she can do, like the the strength that she has, to, like sit down. Yeah, it's amazing. So we're just getting ready because we're gonna go to church. We used to go to church at like at four, like in the afternoon before, and now they actually switched back to eleven, eleven thirty. So that's where we're at.
Here's the progress so far. All her clothes put away. Definitely nothing else fits in there. So once uh, the next few outfits come, we'll get another box for that. What is that? <laughs> More books. Oh. Yeah, that goes in there. We have here in this box uh, toys that she's not going to use anymore, but we're still keeping. And then here we're gonna have toys that we're gonna rotate. So we're gonna start doing that and kind of fix up the shell a little bit more and rotate the things. So we gotta take that camera out. A few things out. We're still gonna make it look pretty, but now that she's um, like recognizing her toys more, looking at them like when she her toys are on the floor, like she looks them like she knows what they are. Um, so we wanna make it a little bit more practical for her when she sees her like toy shelf here. Um, it's just the toys that she's gonna be playing for that week or that two weeks. Or... But yeah, so we wanna do that. We wanna put some like baskets and stuff, so. you guys how we rotated her um what's it called her toy thing okay so up here it's um more like a decor style we have a bible verse we have a candle that says ocean on it a little plant and then this is doubles as a toy decor thing which is a rainbow um, we're going to keep it for now here, and then here is a basket that we're going to use for her changing station, which we have over there. But her actual toys, so we have five books here. These she really likes, we like to like more cartoony books. This one is the one about, and we got Lily for Father's Day. Um, this is my first Bible book, and then this is um, Good Night Moon, which I like to read to her at night. So we have those, and we'll also be rotating books. Next, we just got her these. These are blocks. I feel like she can play with this at different stages. Like now where she's at at six months, they're like chewable and you know, they make sounds. Once she's a little older, she'll be able to like match the shapes because they all have a shape at the top and then something to match at the bottom. So this will grow with her too. So we're keeping this one here. The next section, we have these stack of little like cups from Mushy. And we have this little banana here. That's another like chew toy. Um, 
toy. This is another one that right now is something new that she's learning. We have her bunny, which she takes with her like, pretty much everywhere. She loves this one. And this colorful ball. So right now that's six toys and five books. Again, we'll be using these for a couple weeks and then we'll switch them out. So yeah. So I like how it turned out. I don't know. Do you like it? I love it. I have so many choices and yeah. I think it kind of like frustrates them more than Oh for sure. Yeah. I think it's looking pretty pretty good. We have our donate pile here. We have our trash pile there. Um now we're gonna put away the clothes. Um some other things like her boppy and snuggle me that were really really useful like for I would say like her first four months. Like mm -hmm. we use that a ton, but now it's kinda like not as much, so so we'll keep those for the next the next baby, which is coming. No, I'm just kidding. And then here are toys that she's too big for. So we're gonna keep those again for the next baby. So now all that we have left is this guy here and the bathroom. All right guys, so we finished the room. Yeah, does it feel clean? All right, so let me show you guys how it turned out. So when you walk in, First thing to the right is Ocean's toy shelf. So I already explained what everything there was. Then I have my diaper bag and we have um, this gather mat. Then we have her dresser and changing station. Um, then over here we organized this with some books, vitamins, my makeup, um, cables and stuff that we use, Willie's stretching things and Willie's shoes and chair and ottomans, our bed, Ocean's crib, a little side table area, and a couch and play mat. And then we ended over here. This is what I used to like to work out, my slippers and our giant mirror. Yeah, so it feels so much better once we clean. I don't know, it's like a nice refresh. Minimalism for us, it's not that we don't have things. It's just that everything we do have has a purpose. You know, we don't have a lot of like, we do store things like we just did now, but we don't have a lot of like, if one day, you know, we stored her baby stuff, but it's not if one day, it's when one day we have a baby, we will use those things. And if we don't at that point, then we will donate them to someone that will. So that's kind of how we manage our minimalism. Everything we have has a purpose. Everything we have, we use, we enjoy. Um, everything is to the most good quality things um, so that they like, you know, fade less or waste less. But yeah, we're happy with that. What do you think? <laughs> so yeah, we're done with that. And now we're gonna have some dinner. So we're gonna have broccoli and avocado and steak. Yeah. So we're gonna enjoy that. And see you, we'll see you later. See you later, YouTube.